Girl, your girl is gonna bag this week, okay? A bag, like, I literally work. God damn, it's hot up in this bitch. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Kashara here. Welcome back to a new video. If you are new here, hey girl, hey. What's up? Come join the sleep family. We're lit here, I promise you we are. If you are an OG, hey boo, what's up? Hey boo. How y'all been? Y'all been having a good week? It is currently Wednesday. Um, y'all, I just got up. I was up last night editing um the vlog that just went up today. I'll link it in the card above so you guys can go watch it, okay? It was my vacation vlog and your girl had yeah, a good time okay i really had a good time for some reason like i have not been able to see certain people coming on my video i don't know why i have not been able to see y'all coming so if i don't come in back to y'all i don't i don't know what's going on like i check my i check my whatchamacallit my comment thing to see what i um do i have like some settings on there that's wrong that's not right like i don't know but it's not telling me nothing it's like saying that everything looks good but y'all so let me tell y'all i need to go sorry if the light change i need to go to the bank girl because i hope like my camera i know it's probably shaky i don't know what it probably is but i had to go to i need to go to the bank because let me tell you my son lost his tooth last yesterday and I forgot to put some money up on his pillow. And he's nine, he'll be 10 in January, but y'all, he still believes in the tooth fairy. And if I can keep him young, then I'm gonna keep him young, okay? I hate when people come in and they like, Santa Claus not real, tooth fairy is not real. You know what, what you do with your children is what you do with your children. But if you talk to my child and he let you know Santa Claus is real or the tooth fairy is real, I, it ain't your job to go against on what he know. I don't care what you tell your kids, but what I tell my child is, it's real. Now, when he get older, he can make that decision. I'm believe, still believing it or not. But right now, he's still believing in the tooth fairy. So, I'm going to go to the bank, and I'm going to get him some money. So, this is what I did. I finessed it a little bit, y'all. I was like, well, you know, she probably busy, and a lot of people probably lost, <laughs> lost a tooth yesterday. So, let's, you know, see about this evening. Maybe she'll have something for you this evening. It ain't clicking with him that you know it's me hopefully it doesn't so yeah i got time girl i got time so i'm gonna go correct this mistake that i made i feel awful because i legit was so tired yesterday because i worked monday night and girl let me tell you girl that's all i can say that night I was tired as hell leaving out there, leaving out from work. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. I was tired as hell and I worked for every coin that they give me that night. But I wouldn't trade it for nothing in the world though. <laughs> okay, so tonight my job is having a, if y'all don't know, it's Sleep Tech Appreciation Week, period. Okay, it's our week, boo. It's our week. So anyways, y'all, so we're getting spoiled this week. Y'all already know we're always getting spoiled. They all day. One thing about it, they gonna feed us. We ain't gonna never be hungry, you know? So <laughs> we're getting fed all week. And then tonight we're having this thing. Well, it's like a game night and they're gonna get us something to eat and we're just gonna bond as a work family and i'm not mad at it because i've never worked at a job that really just had celebratory moments you know what i mean so yeah i'm here for it i loved it i love it we love we love to see it we love to see it and y'all okay so let's talk about food that's what i want to talk about so lately y'all i have been really feeling like um when i eat stuff it makes me sick and i'm not trying to make this as a trigger point for anybody um i'm not bashing anybody who has a eating disorder at all I, that's not what i'm trying to do but for me i'm just saying when i eat certain things it's harder for me to digest them and i know i'm getting old because y'all know i'll be 29 next month boom scorpio season period okay <laughs> Style. but y'all know i'm finna turn 29 so my body cannot digest things that it usually could digest when i was younger and i'm making you know i'm being 
I'm noticing things, okay? It's hard after I eat, after I eat certain things where I feel like I could stick my finger. I could make go to the bathroom and make myself up. Like, eating it at the moment. Now, fire. But after so long, I feel like shit. Like, I feel awful. I feel sluggish. I feel like I could vomit, literally. I could really just go and make myself throw up. Sorry. But I'm just saying. I'm just being honest or whatever. So, I've been trying to, like, pay attention lately to the things that I've been putting inside my body. Ah, you know, I want to start, like, working out and eating a little different or whatever. The goal is, if I lose weight, I lose weight. But I'm not trying to lose weight because I feel like I'm fire as fuck and I love my size and I feel like I'm beautiful my size. So, we gotta represent for the plus size queens. But what I don't want to do is feel like shit and be my size. You know what I mean? So, yeah. But I'm trying to find me things that I can eat. I did notice when I eat pork and beef. If I eat a hamburger, it's over with. Like, I can't eat nothing for the rest of the day. If I eat pork, and y'all know I'm always cooking my pork chops. If I eat pork, I notice that. So I'm guessing like red meat is something like I might need to chill on. Um, I don't really eat bread like that, and I know I drink hella drinks, so there's that. Luckily, thank God, I don't have any um, health issues or anything like that. I'm not on any medication. Whew, I don't even want to put that in the universe because I really need that to stay the way it's at. But me for my size or whatever, I'm healthy. How much money y'all be giving y'all kids for the tooth fair? Because I just got $200 out and I think I'm gonna give me something to eat and give him like whatever's left over. I ain't gonna try to spend like too much, but I don't, I don't want to jit my boy, you know? Cause I, he asked this morning, he was like, he wanted something. He was like, five dollars. Is that not enough? Is that enough? I don't know. Not me catching no Popeye's line and ain't nobody in it. I mean, well, it's a few people, but y'all. I'm so nosy. But you got to know, Popeye's, they ain't never open one. The line is all the way to the road because they ain't never got the inside. I feel like they be having to go kill the chicken. They sell because it takes forever to get in there. So, but I'm like, I almost at the mic, girl. And I see this hottie sauce. And somebody told me, like, I love the sweet heat sauce. If you have not tried Popeye's sweet heat sauce, they basically say it's the same thing. And it probably is the same thing. They just put Megan the Stallion label on there for like, you know, what you want to call it, hype. But here's the thing, though, with Popeye's. If y'all going to come out with something new, make sure y'all got some work. Like, make sure y'all up on product. I mean, I don't know. Like, make it make sense. Because right now, it ain't making sense. I think I'm going to try it. I don't know what I want, though. Um, Not R. Kelly in the background. Y'all. <laughs> another topic for another day. Another topic for another day, so. Y'all yeah. never really held made it home. Where you had to I put all money in his pillow. Oh. Well, I have to get the tape too. <laughs> he's like, like he's like, like mommy, like they, they didn't, just she like, didn't get my tooth, but she put the money up under there. You know, Girl, I just, I just dropped my head because again, at this point, I'm just right. like, you know what? Forget it. Get it, but he got um his stuff and i'm home the hottest sauce was it definitely tastes like sweet heat sauce from popeyes but i don't think it's like the same kind of sauce you know what i mean i think it's like a different sauce but it's for something no it's not i think it's like four o'clock so um i need to i don't know if i want to put some makeup on because y'all know we having like this little thing tonight in my job so i don't know if i want to put some makeup on i don't know i don't know oh hey girl happy thursday so y'all i up and edit i have not blended like my lipstick out yet but i'm about to get ready to head to work tonight it is 5 23 Y'all should have been at the house. I ain't even gonna lie to you. But I went to sleep and I actually took some melatonin like around like 10 o'clock and I shouldn't have did that. But 
I did it. So anyways, y'all, I ended up falling asleep and sleeping real hard. I took like six milligram of melatonin those on this damn why I'm so tired, but I'm tired. You hear me? So, um, yeah, but today is Thursday. I have to work tonight. Y'all, so y'all already know it's Sleep Tech Appreciation Week and y'all already know that yesterday we had this thing for my boss. Well, not for my boss, but for Sleep Tech Appreciation Week. They had a thing for us last night. We had played like games and they fed us and stuff like that. It was very nice. It was real nice. Um, everybody just felt like it was family. Even the doctor was there. It was, it was nice. So, I love my boss. If y'all don't know, then y'all need to know. I love my boss. She is super sweet. Um, very understanding. Love her. I love her. And so, y'all, we didn't really, I feel like we missed Boss Appreciation Day. It was like last week. And so this week, like, we got her a card and everybody signed a card. But I really just wanted to do something extra because she's very deserving. She's hardworking. She's very compassionate. And she has a heart of gold. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to send her some flowers. Y'all sent her these flowers. And she loved them. Thank God for my coworker. Shout out to you, girl. If you watch my video, um, she actually went and picked up the flowers for me because the woman that the place that I actually purchased them from they wasn't able to deliver them so thank God um she actually was able to get those and give them to her for me they're feeding us tonight but I don't know what they're gonna have us like what are we gonna eat I won't know that until I get there but she's about to come in and say hey y'all up and edit um a little behind and I'm still seeing her like I got time and it's 5 25 so as long as I make it up before 6 30 I'm okay which I probably will, but I'll probably talk to you guys a little bit later. Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. I don't even know why I'm saying welcome back to my channel. It's another day in a vlog. It's a Monday, a few days later. Girl, I already know. But y'all see, I made my coffee this morning. I wanted it warm. I have not slept all night because I have to work tonight. My new work schedule lately has been Monday, Thursday, and Friday night, which is pretty much what it's gonna be. So it's Monday, I have to be at work tonight. I didn't sleep all last night just to prepare myself to sleep this morning, then wake up at a good time to be able to get everything together. But I did not show y'all that I rearranged my living room again. I think like the last clip that y'all saw was me um, about to rearrange it, and y'all saw that I had that big ass spider on my curtain, girl. like. No, ma'am. I just moved my TV right here. Um, my couch is facing this way. My little one, he's ready for school. Not so happy about it, but we're here. But, excuse me, Lundry. Y'all already know how I am. My little just going to forever be on my couch. But I um put my couch this way so you can be able to have access to walk through here. And you'll also have access to walk through here as well, which I like, because the other way that I had my couch, you was not able to go to enter on both sides. You was only able to enter on one side. But I'm still thinking about moving this to here, bringing my mirror that I have down, that I have upstairs, putting it in that corner with my, right, with my white rug, and kind of like have it aesthetically pleasing. I do need to go to like Hobby Lobby or whatever and pick up like some points and some other stuff I feel like that I want to put on the wall but for right now this is where we're at all of this is going to be cleared up today that is a goal of mine y'all see I got my cup if y'all follow face over matter y'all know she just launched her own lunch her own lunch launch I don't know her own line and these are her cups that she came out with it basically said grace and peace because y'all know she always say that and it also has Corinthians, I think 2 Corinthians 12 and 10 on the back of it. I'm always supporting people. I love coffee mugs, so why not? Hey y'all, so it's a few days. It's not a few days later. One, it is. <laughs> um, like what I'm trying to say. It is a few hours later, sis. A few hours later, and I'm up. Um, like I told y'all earlier, I have to work tonight. It's 2.24. And I know y'all remember me telling y'all that I was going to bring my mirror from upstairs down here and put it in that corner right there. I think I'm about to get ready to do that. I have some extra time on my hands because I did wake up in time. I'm going to make me, but y'all, I need some oatmeal and stuff like that this morning and get my mind together, get ready for work tonight.
Like, what do y'all think I should go with the decor? I need pillows to go on my couch. I don't know what kind of pillows, what color I want to go with with this green. Because y'all see my couch is green. Then my rug is brown. My decor and stuff is like brown. So I don't know what I want to do in that area. But for right now, this is what it is. It's not too bad. Like I told y'all, y'all can come around from this way. You also can walk in from that way. The couch right here. And yeah. I think I kind of like it this way. Y'all know me. I can never make up my mind. So, this is for right now. Here's my breakfast. It looks good. I love peanut butter and my oatmeal. It's like fire. If you don't try it this way, if you haven't tried it this way, you should, boo. It's like really good. The strawberries give it a sweetener. The honey give it a sweetener because my oatmeal is on. Um, this is the maple and brown sugar, so I probably got like too much sugar in it. That's okay though. You know, one day at a time, one step at a time. But this is what I'm gonna eat now, and I don't even know what I'm gonna eat later, but I'm gonna devour this. This is the time. This is the time. You guys i finished my schedule wall girl your girl is gonna bag this week okay a bag like i literally work half the month and then the rest of it i'm off sis as you can see your girl birthday is november 10th and thanksgiving break i'm so excited to spend time with my family um i hope y'all have a good thanksgiving as well but y'all so i just finished putting stuff on here um i really need to invest in giving me some more um markers because this is giving me fall vibes, which that's what I need. That's what I'm going for, right? But I want to like add some color and stuff like that. I need to put a note down here because I need to like say an affirmation to myself every morning when I come up in my office. Yeah, girl, that's what I'm doing right now. Let me go get my laptop because I need to start editing a video. Try to get this up to y'all tomorrow or wednesday y'all already know i ain't got no set days that needs to be a goal i need to set for myself a small goal at least upload two times a week what kind of vlogs y'all like you know like what kind of vlogs y'all want to see because i'm ready to give y'all what y'all need to give i'm gonna be tired as hell but i told myself november is my month new blessings i love when the beginning of the month falls on that monday perfect for me um i need to pack like oh no i did tell y'all about my fashion over clothes y'all girl let me tell you my fashion over clothes to be one of the dresses i'm gonna insert, insert a picture and show y'all looks like a plastic bag on me um the other one was not giving what it was supposed to give in the skirt area so i had to order me another birthday dress so it should be here tomorrow i ordered a few more pieces from shein um, I might give y'all a haul on Shein because I did get a lot of stuff from Shein. A lot, a lot of stuff from Shein. But, um, yeah, so why I order a 3X? Like, I'm not even a 3X. Like, I don't even get what was I, like, what I was thinking. I don't understand it. But I ordered a 3X in those clothes and, yeah. I guess because I was just nervous because I didn't know if it was going to run small so just in case it did i got a 3x but i'm not even a 3x i'm like a 1x 2x kind of thing but hey 
mistakes happen. So I need to send that stuff back off. So I need to print the label for that. I'll probably print that tonight at work. Still drinking on my tea. So y'all know I mentioned in my previous part of my video about how when I eat certain things, it just wasn't agreeing with my stomach. I just didn't like how meat or whatever and a lot of carbs make me feel like I just, I don't know, it just made me feel like shit. I just don't like the feeling of it. And I feel like my body's just not digesting the food the way I need it to digest. So I'm gonna go on this detox um, for the month of November. The thing is, I'm gonna give up meat. I'm gonna try y'all. I'm gonna give up meat for this week and as the week progresses as the month progresses then i'll go up you know and see how long i can go without any meat but when i do start to incorporate be like fish um salmon and fish and shrimp and stuff like that because i feel like i eat too much chicken too much pork and too much beef and y'all already know pork is not even good for you one but um yeah so i really just want to detox my body um starting i wouldn't necessarily say vegan but just go meatless for this week and just see how you know how long i can hang in there i do want to incorporate me working out the goal for me right now is to just overall feel healthy um if i lose weight which i know i'm probably gonna lose weight in the process hey i'm all for it but the plan is for me to just learn some more healthy habits so i can incorporate it in not only my life but into my son's life as well um he basically eat what i eat we eat fast food every single day and i know this is not good and i can like i said i can definitely tell the difference from my body now from when i was younger girl like no ma'am okay so that's what i'm gonna do this week so it's gonna basically be it's basically gonna be meatless week this week as you saw i started off this morning in breakfast and i had oatmeal strawberries honey with peanut butter I don't know what I'm going to have for dinner tonight, but I'm probably going to go to like Walmart or Kroger and try to find um, some different stuff to incorporate so I won't have to eat any meat this week. All right, guys. So I am dressed. I got my makeup and stuff on. Yeah, I think I might just make this as my work week. I feel like it's giving <laughs> what it's supposed to give. I feel like I say that all the time, but I still have my braids up from a month ago and my hair has grown so freaking much i'm gonna try to keep my hair braided until um after my birthday and then i'm gonna take my hair down and like do deep condition protein treatment do some tlc to it because your girl needs a lot of loving at this moment because she a little dry okay but yeah so i'm finished getting dressed i gotta finish packing my work bag but i just want to come in and tell you guys but i want to come in and tell you guys i hope you guys have a wonderful november um I got a lot of stuff that I want to do, a lot of goals that I have set. And if I want to continue next week to do meatless, I can do meatless as well. And I also need to start back studying for my test because I'm ready to be in alignment on everything that God has for me. You know, like I'm ready to walk in my purpose. I'm ready to put my mind to where exactly where I need it to be so I can get to where exactly I need to go, you know. So I know I just need to get my my whole mental together i'm feeling great i'm so happy about my schedule this month um i'm not even gonna put the word tired in my vocabulary because i feel like i come on every video and i'm like oh my god i'm so tired i'm so tired i'm so tired but the thing is i might be tired but i am forever grateful because y'all my schedule and finish like trying to see when i'm gonna work how i'm gonna get hours how i'm gonna pay these bills girl had your girl stressed out and being PRN, there's really nothing that you can do about it. You just have to get in when you fit in. But that is my set schedule for this month, November. So, hey, I'm rolling with it. I'm rocking with it. I thank God, like y'all, I had a moment earlier because I was just like, you know, when you feel like you can't see the light at the end of the tunnel, God always flashed that light and to just tell you to just keep, keep going. Like, keep going. So, when I prayed about how, like, Lord, I got to use my savings. Um, I'm only working, like, two days out of a week or whatever. And, you know, bills going to roll in. Bills going to forever come in. But you know what? I'm going to pray about it. And I'm going to put it in your hands. And my schedule is full. Some days I have four days a week, which just OT. Time and a half. We already get paid overnight pay. Girl girl won't he do it won't he do it won't he come right on time because it's my birthday month it's christmas and then my son's birthday is in january so 
lord i thank you but anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it really wasn't much but that's just like a real raw day in my life video um basically what i do i really don't do anything i feel like my life is so boring so that's why i be having a hard time picking up my camera because i'm just like they probably not gonna like these but you know what some people like it some people don't like it if you want to watch it you can watch it if you don't you don't it's cool with me poo it's cool with me i ain't mad at you okay i ain't for everybody okay i'm not i'm not but for the people that i am for for my lawyer boos i got y'all also wanted to give a shout out to Maisie. i'm gonna put her thing her instagram name right here below she shouted me out for sleep tech appreciation week she tagged me in a post and she always sent me like sweet little messages when i post stuff like that i do notice y'all comment i can't comment back to everybody but the ones who go to extra step and to message me on instagram or follow me on snapchat and stuff like that it doesn't go unnoticed and i'm always willing to give back you know when i can um yeah i love showing my appreciation to you guys because without y'all i would not be able to do this channel or whatever so Maisie, i appreciate you so much thank you for shouting me out you really didn't make a girl feel like i was super special like i was important okay so what i want you to do is on instagram i want you to send me your email address because i want to send you a little goodie so yeah i appreciate all y'all and i'm going to continue to show my love to all y'all because like i said if it wasn't for y'all i wouldn't be able to be the person that i am today because y'all have pushed me more than y'all ever know y'all encouraging words i don't even know y'all but y'all fuck with me y'all fuck with me people that i know don't even fuck with me the way y'all fuck with me and i'm sorry to cuss but i'm just keeping it real so yeah but anyways macy make sure you send me your email on instagram i'm gonna send you a little goodie girly to show my appreciation to you but i'm about to get ready to head out this door i want to come in and close out this vlog thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys like comment and subscribe to my youtube channel hit the notification bell so you guys can be aware on when i upload my video girl and let's get this bag this november i'll see y'all in my next video